We're fishing today with my good buddy, Ryan Nitz, inshore master. We got 15 mole in the live well. Let's see what happens. Oh yeah, this is him. Look at these guys. Ryan's fishing the structure, the sea walls, the docks. I'm fishing the open water. He's looking for a snook, you know, jack too. Got a little eddy. Two right different here. strategies here, you know, because at any moment a monster can swim by a tarpon, a jack, anything can swim in the open water, find my mullet, and you know there's fish just hanging along these walls. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh my gosh. You got him? Yes, you got him. You got him. Stop, 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 stop. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, Ryan. Ryan, what is that? Oh boy, big Joe. Dude, what is it, big jack? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Son. How big do you think this fish is? He's big. <laughs> he's just, dude, he just smoked you. I thought he was gonna take you underneath the dock and break you off. He just barely got, it just barely worked out. Oh my gosh, we got lucky there. We got lucky. You look like you've done this before, Ryan. Oh, second time. And you're just starting out a guide service now, right? Yeah, this, uh, this summer coming up next month will be my first official year guiding. I just got my captain's license about two dude. or three months ago. You're gonna become the inshore man, dude. Yeah. The go-to. I like it, it's cool, you know, through my Instagram I meet a lot of cool people and they want to go fishing and to legally take money from them. I had to have a captain's license, so. Yeah. Watch out, watch out. Oh yeah, 25 pounds all day. <laughs> that is a slob. Oh my gosh, dude. What is going on, buddy? Look at the teeth, guys. Those teeth. You don't play. Dude, Ryan, not that's bad. a great start off to the morning there. Yeah, let's. Uh, we we weren't at that corner for long, so let's get back in there. Uh, I, when he hit my mullet, my mullet flew off the hook, and another no one. Was, yeah, another one was eating it. So there's another one over there. Dude, let's go. Let's go. Here you got a big square platform dock. There's a lot of shade. You're in the corner. There's already a, a flow coming through here, and it's eddying through here. So you got to look for anything different. So we got a lot of difference meeting right here. Um, that jack we just caught was up here on this corner pipe. And what I'm doing is I'm just skipping under here. They snuck certain times of the day. They're going to be up under the docks. And if you don't get it way up under there, you'll never see them. Take him, take him, take him, take him. Those hurt little ones. There's some giants in there, dude. I'm gonna need a new mullet here, guys. I mean, this is uh, those jacks couldn't eat this mullet, but they sure did try. Look at that. Look at the damage. I mean, that is just catastrophic. There's no recovering from that. So, what we're gonna do here is let the mullet struggle for a minute because he's too lively. I'm gonna throw him back in there. Oh, oh, Jack. Jacks are back. Uh oh, watch out, watch out, watch your mullet, man. Watch your mullet. Get the over here, look at my Got him, got him on. Doubled up. Oh, no! He spit it. Look, look the mole's still alive. It was in his stomach the whole time. Look, 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 right here. Oh, oh, oh. Did he just pipe it? I think he just piped it. Yeah. I love Jax. Gosh, dude. Not giant, but he ate a bait almost half his size. These things are unreal. So aggressive. Guys, look at this little bridge. We had to literally put all the rods down. We almost snagged the the, uh, the platform back there. This is uh. Now we're gonna see if there's this, any is, this is this is pushing the limits. We are looking for a giant pipe, like legit pipe. We gotta find a super tiny bridge here, and there's a bunch of little bull sharks here too. We're gonna try to catch those. But there's a big pipe down here, and uh, in this pipe, I've heard stories of monster fish. 
we came all this way. You can hear the pipe, just the water flushing out right there. The mangroves have made a barrier. We cannot get to the pipe. We should at least go look at the pipe. How are you going to do that? We'll just spread the mangroves and look at it. Look at the, the red fish in the snook just sitting there laughing at us, going, ha ha, mangroves. They are the barrier. The wall. It's just a wall, guys. I'm coming out. They're coming up. They're happy. So now we're fishing for big bull sharks. And these things are cool. We saw a bunch of them going towards the pipe. So in our plan, we, we almost stopped. I said, look, let's get all the way to the pipe first, see what's there, and then come back to the bull sharks. That's what we're doing right now. Get ready, get ready. Oh yeah, this is him. Let him eat, let him eat, let him eat, let him eat, let him eat. Got a bite? Got a bite, here we go, here we go. Let him eat, let him eat, let him eat. He's eating it, he's piping it, he's piping it. Here he goes. He's contemplating, deciding what he wants to do. Go nice and slow until I feel tension. There we go, we got him. We got him. Shark on. We got you, buddy. Baby bull shark. That's probably the smallest bull shark I've ever heard. And he's still stripping. Light tackle shark fishing. Oh, he is cute. Look how cute he is. All right, let's be very cautious in how we grab him. I think I'm gonna grab his head. Baby bull shark, guys. Man, he was so much fun. He fought hard. Tell you what, this is probably the smallest bull shark I've ever caught. Oh. There he goes. Not the release I was looking for, but he's fine. The shark is plenty fine. Just swim right back in the mangroves. We did it, Ryan. We did it. Did it. We had to work hard for that shark. Let's, there's another one tailing right what, here. What? Yeah, just when you reel in a minute, there's another one tailing up. Dude, so he got your line. He's, he's got you, dude. You're hooked up. No, no, no. It's snag. Oh, it is? Yeah. Oh, man. I gotta go get it. So that one. line, that tight line, you guys. Tight lines. Line? That'll get you. Look at the size of that mullet, guys. Jumbo mullet for a massive fish. Oh, it's over. It's over. You got him? Yeah, ready? Yep. Nope. What, what is it? Oh, he ate it again. No. Yeah. What is it? Oh, huge snook. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Ryan, that thing's studly. Don't lose him now, don't lose him. Here. Uh oh, uh oh. We're in a tight spot here. Uh, nah, that might be a slot. It might be a slot? Piped it, dude. Look at that. Nice. 31. You're right, Ryan. That's a slot right. fish. Now, Let's most see. people know me as a catch and release guy, but I keep about one of these a year. And unfortunately, this is going to be my. That's gonna, be, that's gonna be the one that's gonna die? This is gonna be the one that dies. Are we gonna eat this thing later? We are. I like it, dude. We are gonna eat them. Oh my gosh, Ryan, what was that? What was that? Ryan's just slaying the fish today. How big was he? Big. Giant? Yeah, he's gonna. You go, here. Come on, Ryan, come on, come on. You're done. He's in there. What is that? He's in there, he's in there, he's out. He's out? Now you're going to the next one. Oh, you're done now. You're out. Oh, no, he's out, he's out. There he is, there he is. Dang, guys, Ryan Nitz slaying today. Nice, All right, dude. a little ghetto permit action here. And he's gone. Quality release there, Ryan. Like it. That's the Palm Beach release. All right, here we go. Now, this ain't gonna be like a normal jackpot here. Oh, oh, my God.
How are they not destroying it? The hook's gigantic. The leader feels heavy. We're just walking the dock here and we found some baby flying fish. Now these things are really cool. You've seen the big ones on our channel. We're gonna show you right now what a little one looks like. Oh, he flew away. He flew away. He flew out of the net. You can see me. Where are you gonna catch it? We're just gonna show it to the camera and we're gonna put it back. No, I'm not. Oh, so fast. <laughs> oh, big shot, big shot. Oh my gosh, Ryan, Ryan, Ryan. Ryan's hooked up again on my rod. Is this a circle hook? Circle hook, yeah. On my rod again, guys. So, I came to this dock right now to try to dip net a flying fish. Got distracted again. Ryan's just been focused today. I have not been focused. Hey, there's Ryan, super focused. Catching a fish on my rod, yep. You know, and uh, we saw these baby flying fish. We're like, yeah, let's try to dip net one of them. And there's my fish, jumping. Beautiful. Good job, Ryan. I'm glad someone can catch fish. Left-handed. I know, right? Just a fish magnet. What can I say? Look at that, another ten-pounder in the boat. He can catch fish. And there it goes. Good job. How are you guys doing over there with the flying fish? Uh, sucking real bad. It was your day, bro. It was my day. We all have our days. Yeah, it just wasn't my day today. I mean, look, I was distracted trying to catch a flying fish. I put my rod on. You had the magnum. What? I put on a big mullet, but I, you know, even the pull, I put the big mullet back, put a little mullet on, and hit it. I stepped off for five seconds, and boom, you hooked one. Okay. Little rod. So. I got uh, I mean, we, we, we caught a couple of jacks today. Couple jacks. Yeah, a couple jacks. Got a slot snug. We had some epic top water fish. If you guys enjoyed that, that was awesome. Little backcountry bull. Yeah. That yeah. was actually cool. That's the smallest bull shark. You know, I like catching big fish, but I also like catching my smallest ones. You know, so that's a new PB today. And first, honestly, first those one. small ones are probably more dangerous than the big ones. I think. Guys, look at that. He just jacked up my rod there. I mean. My nice custom rod, and it's all—it's hard to handle those. I, it was hard to get him off that. He just really wanted to eat that rod. But all in all, pretty it was good, a good day. day. Yeah, yeah. Hey, new captain here, guys. Ryan Nitz. I mean, is, should I call you captain? <sighs> it feels like captain's so cliche these days. I know. I'll just call you Ryan. Just call me Ryan. All right, guys. If you want to go fishing with Ryan? He's now a chart captain, and his link is in the description. Check him out. He's in, if you want to catch big inshore fish, and this isn't even. According to Ryan, this is like just getting it warmed up. Like he's not even like, you know, I fish these waters too, and he's he's got some secret spots up north of here, and they're epic. So stay tuned, guys. We're gonna be doing some serious inshore videos with Ryan here, yeah. inshore master. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.